Now, if you're wondering why we've gone all posh with this champagne lark, it's because tonight is our 50th Wakey Wakey television show for the BBC. Now, when you've got that long and you haven't been tumbled, it's worth celebrating. Tonight, BBC means bubbly for Billy Cotton. <laughs> well, now, ladies and gentlemen, I'm always pleased to welcome our next guest, because if you don't know already, we used to catch tiddlers in St James's Park together. Max Bygrave. Oh, you've stopped, eh? Oh, oh it's all right. Here. How about some champagne, Max? That's a good idea. <laughs> I was going to say, Dad. Shall I bring it in a bucket? In a bucket? What do you think we are, horses? <laughs> in a bucket. In a cup! In a cup. In a cup. <laughs> I think I'd better go off and see something about what he's in, doing. No, no, wait a minute. We've got some patter first. Have we? God, blimey, we've been rehearsing three hours. <laughs> Bill, it's not true that you're Lord Rockingham, is it? <laughs> I think Maxi boy is taking it out of Billy boy. <laughs> no, I think it's only right for all your contribution towards the entertainment world. I think you deserve a night or this. Sir Alec Guinness, Sir Laurence Olivier. I can see it now. Sir William Cotton. <laughs> Sir William Cotton. Yeah, and Lady Breeze. Yeah. <laughs> You've got another line here. Look, he's gone. Oh. That's all right. I'll do it. You see, I'll tell you what, you see, when you, when you do television, I don't know if you know this, but you have all your words written there, look. <laughs> I couldn't see that one. <laughs> Idiot. Anyway, um, you see, when you do television, sometimes you, you, you have your words written out. If you've got a lot of songs to sing, you see, you have them all, all placed there. But sometimes the cameraman he forgets about these words on the front of the camera, you see, and he goes right back with the camera. And if you happen to have mince, minces that are a bit weak, you know, you can't... I'll show you what I mean. Hang down your head, Tom Dooley. Hang down your head and cry. Hang 
hang down your head, Tom Dooley. Oh, boy, you're gone. Do Of them, Russ. I think they're good, Mr. Cotton. Very good. Good. And may I congratulate you right here and now on your 50th anniversary in show business. Thank you. What do you mean, 50th anniversary? <laughs> this is our 50th show, I tell you. <laughs> Sorry. Well, it's an easy mistake to make, isn't it? <laughs> I don't want any of your cheek, my lad. Now, what are you going to play? Side saddle. <laughs> I don't care about the position. What's the music? Side saddle. And you made that joke last time, and it wasn't funny either. You know, one of these days, I'm going to put you right at the top of the hit parade with my boot. <laughs> That's a better joke. <laughs> you, better joke, better joke you go and play, and I'll tell you later. So here is Russ Conway to play his own composition, which he wrote under a non plume. He's dead scared to write it under his own name. Here it is, <laughs> Side Saddle. <laughs>
Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Now I'd just like to say, just like to say, thank you to everybody. Thank you very much, everybody. Shut up. Shut I don't up. believe in making long speeches. Don't. <laughs> <laughs> but I want you to know that we've enjoyed doing these 50 shows for you, and we hope you've enjoyed them too. Well, <laughs> you must have done, otherwise you wouldn't have put up with them for so long. Anyway, I'd just like to say this. I hope we're still together in the day I say thank you. <laughs> 
And thank you to, for watching our 100th show. Good night, and God bless you. Good night.